it's a beautiful afternoon and we are just here in the bus terminus let me just show you around on the other side you can see floriana and this other side is the bus terminus so let me just take a good picture and just the other side we have the furniture hotel the sun is a lot the sun is a lot i don't really want to put my glasses on because my shirt on because i've been wearing it for quite a while and i'm feeling like my nose you know i have big nose so they always get affected anyway this is for nisha hotel and we have some monuments around anyway i'm not gonna go that side because i don't i don't really have that much time but i hope you like the place this is how the area looks like but the other side we have Phoenicia hotel it's one of the oldest hotel here in valletta and it's a five star and the best thing about it like it has you know that um the cult the multi cult and all that let's pass by here let's go this side so that we will pass as we see the area hey here in case you are new here thank you so much for joining and please kindly consider subscribing please don't forget to subscribe my name is jumba Martin and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for always coming back so here we have uh, we have one of the one of the monument here and we have another one the independence monument the other side there is a lot of tourists here you can see you can see them this is one of the tourist spot they love coming here and also in case you want to do horse riding and all that you can actually get them here it's so easy you can actually get them here you see the other side we do have the horses so you can go there oh you can also go go to the other side close to st peter's uh st paul street there is um there is other people where you can get where when you're heading to the upper baraka garden you can also order you can also go and book for horse riding from there as well me i don't know how to do it so i guess i can't do it so let's keep on moving there is a lot of tourists right now it's a busy season even today i feel like it's better if you come during the weekend it's really really a lot well let's keep on going and see what the other side here this other area i've shown you guys like a million times like a million times the in the independence monument at the triton tower so let's just turn one two three and ta -da! there we go that's the independence monument one of the landmarks of valletta i'm sure you've seen it more many times and today i'm not going to say history about it if you want to know about it just go and search the Trout triton fountain in valletta and you're gonna get all the history about it i've said uh, if you don't want to go and google also just check my videos you will see there is um i've put, posted a video about the triton fountain so yes let's keep on moving you see how crowded it is today there is a lot of people so and also when you're here if you want to get street food you are very hungry you want to get street food just on the other side okay this side you see there yes there is a lot of canteens there where you can buy the street food one of the multi street food is uh, the pastiti or the meat pie chicken pie you know all those those are the multi street food and you can buy beverages as well if you want um, any soft drinks you want wine you want beer you can buy they call them the multi beer it's called chisk so you can buy it and also apart from that in case you want to order bolt or to request for tax you can easily get them here you can easily get them here and also if you want to go and get the bus you can actually get them there their buses are like green and white and they are so beautiful very very beautiful if you are a resident it's only free but if you're not a resident you will have to pay two euro fifty cent in the bus and yes you'll be ready to go anyway let's keep on moving so we don't really get late so you can see there is a lot of people having their lunch now i actually wanted to go and buy one but i'm feeling like i don't want to make a queue so i will buy the one that is close to my work place i feel that side will be better so let's let me let you enjoy you know these birds here there are too many trust me in kenya that is food we call it njiwa yes we call it njiwa in kenya that is food 
even the birds themselves in Kenya they will run away from people they can't even stay close they will really run away because they know hey if they catch me I'm going to be still tonight so they, they will run away but here they are really friendly you know like they will be here they can come even when you have food in your hand they will come land in your hands and they will feed from your hand because you know they know very well that they are very safe very very safe so let's keep on moving as we see a lot of people here in the square enjoying themselves leave a comment guys let me know where you're watching from it has been a while and yeah and you need to come also with suggestions because yeah you need to suggest so that i will know where and what you want me to do like which areas you prefer what you want to see a trip is coming very soon at least one of different country in europe so yes we're gonna go there so let's keep on moving and leave a comment let me know where you're watching from right now i'm just crossing the the main gate this is the main gate to, you see yes i'm actually in the main gate to valletta for pedestrians only it's not by car only pedestrians here it's really crowded see okay the other side even now it's better when i reach inside you will see how busy it will be so we keep on moving last time i passed here it was at night so i think you guys didn't have a very nice view but today yes at least today I've tried. Anyway, I will try to improve and do as much as I can. We are still on the learning progress process, but yes, we're gonna do the best. So you see some people are there, you know, because Valet is just a tour that you can do by legs. So some people they're there with their tour only by walking. So you just hire a travel agency that a tour guide that will guide you around just by walking because the whole of Valletta, the entire city you can do by walking. So you can see them there with their guide there yes and we keep on moving it's so crowded and we have some the other side as well like different groups so valletta is the capital city of malta in case you didn't know this is the capital city i kind of like it because i feel like it's so quiet compared to i went to st julian's st julian's it's so beautiful actually if you're in st julian's you will think like you're in dubai but it's the city of nightclubs it's so noisy and so let me say lively in case you like to party it's the best place but here i love it because it's kind of uh, classy very quiet and also they follow a lot of like they they try to maintain their culture and their um, how do we say they maintain a lot of their culture even the buildings you cannot build modern houses it has to to be like you use specific type of stone so that it will maintain their their culture it will be the same with other buildings so that's one of the things that i found out here i don't really think we're gonna go the other side let's start moving from the other street and then later on we will come to this other street guys you see how crowded it is and this is just one of it if we go to the other street it's a lot it's a lot of people so within these streets you can buy anything you want to buy the shoes the clothes the makeup the medicine in case you want if in case you want food anything you want you can easily find in this street because this is one of the main streets I think I need to be very careful because guys, let me just show you where I'm going. This is where I'm going. You see the people are too many and I feel I'm gonna fall down if I don't really concentrate. So let's call it a day or what do you think guys? Okay, let's move a little bit and there is also a lot of music so I don't really wanna take a chance. So let's just do it later. Thank you so much for all those who joined. I really appreciate and yeah. 
keep on coming keep on supporting me subscribe in case you haven't subscribed and see you next time i love you guys ciao